That Gilbert, what a tosser. I mean, ooh, I'm Mr. Gilbert. I'm such a big, huge, massive freak. And I just love to suck the headmaster's balls. And then... Is he behind me? Did you hear any of that? Oh, yes. Can we start again? She's fit. Yeah, I'd fuck her. Thanks very much. No, but I would, though. Wouldn't you? Hmm. Well, if she's my mum, no. But if she wasn't? She is, though, so... No, but what he's saying is, if she wasn't your mum, would you fuck her? Oh, are we still doing this? So you would fuck her? No. Feisty one, you are. What? Feisty one, you are. Why are you talking like that? It was Yoda. From Star Wars. It's the same impression I was doing on the coach for about an hour. Oh, was that what that was? Oh, good. I thought you might, you know, have a problem. <laughs> no. Or Asperger's, maybe? Wrong again. Have you ever been tested for anything? Good one. You are banned from going inside. Why? Because you do something like steal my mum's knickers to sniff and then wank with. With? Yes, with. And then you'll take great pleasure in telling me how you wrapped my mother's knickers round your cock and used the friction generated whilst thinking about her tits to make you come. Hello, Will. Oh. Hello, Mr. Cooper. There's a lot of noise down the hall. It sounds like a party. Do you fancy it? Party? Hmm. Cool that sounds. You know you're never, ever going to get laid. You are all right with me seeing Lauren later, aren't you? Yeah, of course. She's pretty cool, actually. Is she? <laughs> Fuck! Oh, you know, baby, I nail sticks! Hello. Hello, everyone. Can somebody call me an ambulance? Because I'm in trouble. Time is moving really, really slowly. And everything is flat. I need you to call me an ambulance. Or failing that, my mummy. I really want my mummy because... And I'm not being dramatic, but I think I might be dead. I am a man who has recently bought a house in the local area, and I'm having a, a housewarming party. And uh, I'll also probably need some um, alcohol. I've had enough of your lip. Oh, you'd like my lip, wouldn't you? Right round your bell end, if Mr Chippy doesn't get there first. What's he going to knock up? A closet for you to hide in, you bumder! Is it right, Neil, that Thorpe Park has one of only two pulley launch coasters outside North America? I don't know. It is right. Room for one more at the front? Sorry? One more at the front. Why are there now three people at the front? Sir, if you could just get... They've on. pushed in! We've spent over an hour queuing specifically for the front, and they've pushed in! Sir... Get them off! Get them off and make them move! Fucking pushing in. Well, it doesn't matter. We'll sit at the back. Sir, if you Are they so dumb they think it's OK to push in? Make them move! Shut up, you plum, and get on the ride. Sir, it's the last ride of the day. Please get on. Fucking fine! I'll just, I'll just get on! I'll just get on and sit at the front next to these inconsiderate assholes. I'm the worst human being in the world. Are you OK, Will? Fine, thanks. Be back for you in a minute. You know you're starting to flare up! Yup! Thanks, Lauren! Won't be a minute! Is that a fish? Yes, Lauren! It's a fucking fish! Give me a minute! Look, I put a lot of effort into this. I made a really nice cock o van. Cock of what? Oh, you don't help yourself, do you? Oh, yes, I see. Cock o van. Very mature. It actually means chicken in wine, doesn't it, Patrice? What? Well, it does. And it doesn't mean cock up my ass or cock on my head, or... You've got some cock in the back of a van. Or that I got a cock in the back of a van. Could I have three pints, please? Do you have any proof of age? You have my word. I've done it with two different girls. I've had 11 lovers already. Five girls, actually. Sorry, it was, it was five, not two. All right, stud. Who were they, then? Well, there's a girl I met in Australia. Australia? Yep, I went on holiday. When was that? 2005. So you were 13? I was very mature for my age. Oh, older woman then, was she? No, she was a couple years younger, actually. So she was 11? Christ, no! I mean... Yes, I, I, I suppose she must have been. Jesus, 11. I don't know what your problem is. I've never been out with a girl I liked anyway. What, apart from the last one who made you cry? Well? Oh, that is bang out of order. What? After everything he said? Yeah, but some things just aren't OK.
You all right, Jay? Yeah, I'm fine. Apologise. For that? Yes, for that. Well, I've literally no idea what the rules are, then. We're going up to London on Saturday. Clubbing. Do you want to come? Sounds fun. We'd love to go. Which club are you going to? We're going to one of the big ones. One of the big, cool ones, right in the middle of London. All right. Which one? Um, the land of... The sound of... We usually go to the Astoria. And that's exactly where we're going. So do you go clubbing a lot, then? Me? <laughs> yeah, you. Um, y yeah, 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 of course. Dancing on the podium, probably. Or up by the speakers, where it's, if anything, too loud. How's your revision going? Yeah, not bad. Pretty good. Got an excellent schedule sorted, colour-coded and balancing my time well. Got some drinks here to help, Pro Plus, that sort of thing. Right. And nothing's fucking going in. Nothing. I mean, look at this. I must have read about the accountability of legislatures to citizens 50 times. And I still don't know what it means. I'm starting to doubt if legislatures is even a word. It doesn't look like a word anymore. None of them do. They just look like squiggles on a page. I'm not saying don't give to charity. Do give to charity. I'm just saying you can give without supporting this egotistical vanity fest. My daughter is one of the models. Then you've failed her. What? God, five pounds, please. Was it that, Mackenzie? Sir, I need to go to the toilet. Again? Yes. Well, you can't. Sorry? It'll be the fourth time in an hour. You'll have to wait. Pretty sure you can't do that, sir. If I have reason to believe you're cheating, I can. And I do. So I have. Now get on with your paper. Oh, God, no. Phil? Phil? Oh, no. Phil? Oh, Jesus. I thought it was a fart, sir. I thought it was safe. Hello, stranger. Charlotte. Hi. Charlotte. Here. Yeah, good spot. Yes. Ha. No. I mean, what are you doing here? Well, I had a reading week, so I thought I'd come home. Didn't know this was your sort of thing. You know, fashion. Oh, it's not. I think it's shit and everyone taking part in it is a vain, talentless twat. I'm in it. Apart from you. Uh, and maybe Si. <laughs> Why did no one tell me you're in it? Well, I didn't know if I could make it, so they put me down as, like, a special guest or something really embarrassing, just because I once did some catalogue modelling. Underwear? No. You are going to come watch me, though, aren't you? Even though I'm a talentless twat. Oh, yeah! No, no, I was only joking about that. Oh, yeah, no, I'm really behind this whole thing, taking the money, helping set it up. Why are you trying to ruin this event, Mackenzie? Good timing. Do you think kidney patients like me should die? Is that it? Nah, come on, mate. That's a bit extreme. Is he trying to stop you coming in, too? No, I'm one of the models. Oh, you must be Charlotte. Oh, wowza, Rooney. <laughs> Are you aware this week's was trying to stop people giving money to charity? Well? No, that's not entirely correct. Look, Alistair, why don't we go and have a chat about this somewhere different, eh? No, let's talk about it here. Wasn't a request. See you later, Charlotte. What are you doing? Are you trying to wheel me away? This thing's got brakes, you know, you can't just roll me off. You're trying to sabotage this event. I won't stand for it. You know what I am? I won't stand for it. I won't have it. Boom, boom. This is my special day and you're trying to ruin it! I'm gonna go and get ready. I think I got away with that. It's a long story, Neil, but the salient facts are these. Recently, I've had a bit of a nervy tummy due to stress, I think. And all the energy drinks and Pro Plus. Perhaps. And in the exam, I took a risk and it backfired. I went to fart and instead shit myself. <laughs> <laughs> God, next term. Do you think anyone's gonna remember my little accident? Yes, of course they will. Well, at least they won't call you Briefcase Mong anymore. Well, that's good. No, they'll call you Shit Pants Mong. <laughs> or oh, Shitty Shitty Bang Bang. <laughs> Any more? Wayne Pooney. Take shit. <laughs> Dr Pooh. The Lion, the Witch and the Specky Kid who shit himself. <laughs> we can keep this up all summer, you know. Brilliant. Looking forward to it. <laughs>